Hello, welcome to the product demo of Just Billing Android app for restaurant business. From takeaway to dine-in, ice cream parlor or fast food center, Just Billing will be perfect point of sale application for your business. In this video, we'll see how Just Billing professional version works for a restaurant business using an Android device. After login, you will be taken to the application dashboard. Icon present here are the quick access of most important features like invoicing, customers, products, inventory and expenses. Also we can check most significant sales related reports. How to create invoices? Let us start with billing. Click on the blue invoicing icon, billing cut opens. You can see right side of the screen has all the item list. Select items as per customer's choice. Swipe from right side of the screen. Item categories will open. Item can also be selected from category section. If you want to make changes in selection or quantity, simply tap on the item. A pop-up will come. Add or remove quantity as required. If you want to remove an item from cart, simply hold on the item and swipe from right to left direction. We can give discount to customers. Discount can be as per amount or as per percentage that we need to decide. If the store runs any promotional coupon, discounts can be availed by applying promo code. Click on proceed. Customer details page opens. These are not mandated fields. However, if you capture customer details, you will be able to run customer loyalty program. If it's a new customer, add customer's name and contact number. In Just Billing app, Customer's contact number works as loyalty card. In case of a regular customer, simply search with name or cell phone number. System will fetch the remaining details. Click on payment. System direct user to payment mode page. Customer can pay via multiple payment options for one single transaction. Let's consider for this example, customer is paying some amount by card and remaining amount by giving vouchers. These vouchers can be issued by shop earlier or it can be a third party voucher like Sodexo or Zeta. Once we receive the entire payment from customer, tap on finish option to complete this billing transaction. As you can see, Just Billing is enabled to generate GST billing. Click on next invoice. Billing page opens for next customer. How to do delivery? Swipe from left side of the dashboard. Go to order. On top side of the billing screen, there's a rectangle symbol for sales order type. Tap on it. Select home delivery mode. Select items as per customer's need. Proceed to next step. Since it's a home delivery, details like customer's name, contact number and delivery address is mandatory to enter. If customer provides any additional information, please mention it here. If the outlet has received the payment from customer, click yes. If the customer choose to pay at the time of food delivery, click no. Due payment can be collected later point of time. Let's consider this customer is paying via mobile wallet. As we can see, most of the mobile wallet options are available with Just Billing. Select the one which your customer wants and finish the transaction. Kitchen order ticket. Food that your customers have ordered will appear in kitchen order section. Chefs in kitchen can refer this to avoid any confusion with ordered items and sequence of orders. Once an order is ready, just hold on the respective KOT and select OK if the order is ready. Other important features of billing. Top right corner of the billing screen has a dollar or currency symbol. Touch on it. Different price list will open. This price list can be specific to happy hours or festive season where item price will be different from default price list. Select some items of your customer's choice. Now for some reason customer might wants to cancel his purchase. Go to the extreme top right corner button, tap on clear. Your billing cart is empty now. Select items for your next customer. While billing, this customer might ask you to put the bill on hold as he needs to pick few more items. In this case, select the hold option and continue billing for other customers. Once a customer whose items was on hold comes back to billing counter, recall his bill, add or remove item and proceed to payment. Customer Management Now we are coming back to Dashboard. Customer option gives you the list of your existing customers with their contact information. You may add or edit it. Maintaining customer details 
हेल्प स्टूडेंट लॉयल्टी प्रोग्राम प्रोडक्ट मैनेजमेंट सिलेक्ट प्रोडक्ट आइकन सेम वे यू विल गेट द लिस्ट ऑफ ऑल योर आइटम्स विथ आइटम डिटेल्स क्लिक ऑन एड टू एंटर अ न्यू प्रोडक्ट इन्वेंट्री मैनेजमेंट लेट्स क्लिक ऑन इन्वेंट्री सिलेक्ट अ पॉसिबल एडजस्टमेंट सिनेरियो लाइक ब्रेकेज इनिशियल स्टॉक लॉस फिजिकल काउंट एक्सेट्रा सिलेक्ट प्रोडक्ट्स पुट द क्वांटिटी क्लिक ऑन प्रोसेस इन्वेंट्री विल बी अपडेटेड शॉर्टली एक्सपेंस मैनेजमेंट एक्सपेंस ऑप्शन गिव्स अ लिस्ट ऑफ एक्सपेंसिस वेन एवर एनी ऑपरेशनल एक्सपेंस टेक्स प्लेस एंटर द एक्सपेंस डिटेल्स फ्रॉम दिस सेक्शन पुट एक्सपेंस डेट choose the category as per the type of product or service purchase so that you get to know how much you have spent for what purpose click on save once required details are entered this summarizes key feature of just billing application settings if you go to the application setting option from here you can customize just billing application as per your need like you can configure barcode scanner type default billing mode payment option which your business doesn't consider can be disabled from this section choose the bill delivery mode and configure settings subscription renewal click on my subscription you can see how many days are remaining for the license to get expired click on renew option next click on get new subscription code choose your subscription duration and pay accordingly click on buy now tap continue choose payment mode enter required details and complete the transaction once the payment is done duration to use just billing will be increased support option would assist you to handle this app efficiently for any query check it in the faq section if you need any more assistance you can raise service request directly to us from service request option contact us for any query or assistance